here we go again. Now we've been fighting in, in Iraq and Afghanistan for over 10 years. And now we're going back to Iraq. We pulled out of Iraq barely a year ago. Now we're going back there. Because obviously we never won that war. And between Iraq and Afghanistan, we have spent trillions and trillions of dollars. And our soldiers are still getting killed. Now it's a general. Now it's a general. Not a common soldier. Now it's a general being killed. And there is no explanation. It seems like the rebels have gotten stronger instead of weak by whatever we've been doing there for the last 10 years. We have spent trillions of dollars and only Wall Street, Wall Street is the winner. They're the real winners. We're the losers. If we were to take those trillions of dollars and invest it in our citizens, each and every household in America could probably receive $75,000. And can you imagine what they can do with $75,000? They can put it back into the economy. They can send their kids to college. But no, no, we continue, we continue to feed Wall Street. Where will it end? Whatever happened to the anti-war movement? Whatever happened? I don't know what happened to the anti-war movement. We need a new movement. That's all I know. Whatever happened to Occupy Wall Street? I wonder where they're at now. I wonder where they're at right now.